This landing in Maine, with every metaphor I needed to write, there are two simple seconds where your entire life is on pause and you see the world from a watercolor painting's perspective. You wrap your fingers in the wind as though it's fine silk, and you feel every rush the adrenaline junkies told you about and more. When I was in preschool, I saw a boy jump off the jungle gym and break his arm. I went into grade school with the nickname Frady Cat. In first grade, my best friend's father robbed a gas station and was shot in the shoulder by a police officer. I'll never forget how his eyes had lost all their color the next day in class. I saw the blood of my first period in sixth grade gym and renamed my own body War Ground. My mother bought me white roses to welcome me into womanhood. And I remember wanting to tell her I did not want to be a woman. I want to hold fearlessness in my own hand as though it were a weapon. So many of my middle school regrets were held in my spine and I was sure it could crack at any moment like a wishbone in the center of a tug of war so much of my sleep was captured by flashbacks asking what if in my head constantly. What if I had punched the boy in my science class who called me a psych? What if I had told the girls who asked me personal questions to piss off? Would I be considered brave then? I went up the zip line screeching in terror, but at the top all I could think of is that there are 96 words in the Sanskrit language for love, and if there is any word in the world to describe this feeling. Later that day, I went to a playground with my cousin, and I was still too scared to jump off the jungle gym. <laughs> Bravery is more than swimming with sharks and skydiving. Bravery is walking out of the closet with pride. Bravery yeah. is basking in the light at the end of the tunnel. Woo! Bravery is simply existing. Because we've all got such heavy hearts, our loved ones have bruises on their palms the size of oranges from trying to hold them. I tasted the word brave when I finally felt grounded, and nothing has ever tasted sweeter.